Here we have the all new 2023 Lexus RX 350H. This is the fully loaded luxury or in Canada, the executive package in Nebula Gray. So you're gonna have your 21 inch high alloy wheels, painted fender flares on the front and the rear of the vehicle. It has the triple beam headlight system with the automatic intelligent high beams, headlight washers, fog lights, turning signals, parking sensors. It's got the all new grille exclusive to the luxury style, which is painted halfway just below the Lexus logo there. And it's a heated emblem as well. In the front, you have the headlight washers, 360 camera lens there. It is a hybrid engine, so I'll show you really quick. Here's the 2.5 liter four cylinder engine with the electric engine paired in it. That powers your front wheels. And then it has a 235 combined horsepower and has a separate engine that actually powers the rear wheels for the all wheel drive system. This one, we have the body side molding. You get your electronic door latch system on the car. Nice and solid. It has one of my favorite features in the back here. The wraparound taillights with the Lexus logo, RX 350 hybrid. It has the, head, the rear backup camera washing nozzle as well. And inside, nice and quick tailgate. You do have the, the inverter, 1500 watt in the back here. It has power folding rear seats that go up and down. And then underneath, we have uh, your spare tire, jack and tools. The battery for that actually starts the car is found back here. So if you ever need to charge it, that's where it is. It has a kick sensor for the rear gate, backup sensors in the back. It has the vents for the hybrid battery. Now this one has the peppercorn interior. So if you want to have a look at that, kind of has the ultra suede on here and in the, the middle part here, a uh, power folding seat feature there. It has the center console in the back with the cup holders. And then down here, you're gonna have your USB-C ports, heated seats, cooled seats in the back here too. Storage, you get the panoramic roof up in the top, which is a really nice feature. And then on the driver's side, it has the seat extensions that extend out. You can raise and lower the seat up and down in the front or the rear, lumbar support, uh, in and out or up and down uh, for your lower back. And then I'll show you the seats here. Really, really nice with that peppercorn interior, which is also found, you get the ultra suede with the Mark Levinson audio system, that brown leather on the, the dash. And you get some storage here, power tilt and telescopic steering wheel, automatic headlights, three seat for memory seats. And we'll get in. And you do see it has the infrared lights there that'll detect for your eyes if your eyes are on the road or you're falling asleep at the wheel. Push to start. With all the nice animations. Yeah, you get that seven inch display there too which it basically has all the controls and stuff that are done through here um, you get the advanced heads-up display which hopefully you can see so these are the touch sensor controls on either side of the wheel that will control up in the heads-up display and looking down here it's got your standard 14 inch display screen on the loaded package. You'll come with navigation, wireless car and Android Auto, automatic uh, climate control with all your heat systems and everything with eco mode. And down below you got the, this is to enable the self parking feature, as you can see here, which if my seatbelt was on, you could see it actually has the option to park itself. 
and you'll have the 360 camera option too that pops up there as well. Down below you have some storage there, USB-C port and your data USB cable port. Wireless charging pad with some storage. It has the nice uh, ash wood with the Sumi ink feature. So, uh, and then for drive over down, reverse over and up, P to park. You got your EV mode switches, automatic engaging parking brake with your brake hold option. This will open both ways depending on which side of the seat you're on. Passenger seat has the same controls as the driver. You get your ambient lighting that's up in through here on your door switches and through the doors and then the floor, which can be controlled just through here under vehicle customized illumination color or theme depending what you want to set it to and then you can see it'll have sort of that almost purple glow now that you can kind of see and there the sun's just a little too bright so if you have any questions about this car or any of the other vehicles i do have more videos in my channel so make sure you subscribe and hit like below and watch some more. Thanks for watching. This is Mike Linterman at Lexus South Point.